so before we start this episode, I just want to say just a few words to um, lose. It's my own ring light. It was a very, very good ring light. Very loyal and welcome everybody. Welcome back to my channel. And seeing from my thumbnail and the topic title of this video, you can see that this video is not a TTI or a story time video like my other videos have been. I just decided to take a little break from the TTI series, you know, go on hiatus. You know, let's just call that season one. <laughs> so we'll come back to that later. But I just want to do some, you know, other videos, branch out a bit, so on and so forth. And just explore a little bit more and see, you know, what kind of videos I can do, so on and so forth, so that you guys can be more entertained and, you know, have a little more variety. I have my little family here. I get bored every day. I'm a week of some story. You understand? Like, mm. we don't shake it up over here. But yeah, from the topic and title of this video, you can see that today I'm gonna talk about the most annoying things happening right now in Jamaica. And quite honestly, uh, them something I just thought emerged since 2020. So I'm not gonna believe everything about 2020. 2020 is trash. You need to pack up and guy yard. So let's go get right into the video. What's the most annoying thing happening right now? Everything. Everything annoying. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Come back next week for a brand new <laughs> For real, for real. <laughs> Let's start off with the first thing that I had to talk about that's annoying starting in 2020. Fleets. No, I'm not hitting out against the actual thing, fleets. Like, I'm not bashing Twitter for getting stories. I'm not bashing Twitter stories, not saying anything about Twitter stories. You know, yeah, sure, it's kind of weird that every single app did follow Snapchat and just start adding stories. It's mostly Microsoft Word with stories or Excel with stories. But I'm not bashing that. I'm not that I'm bashing. I'm bashing the name, fleets. Now, as a pharmacist or just a science medical mind, there is something that comes up when you hear the word fleet and it's not Twitter story. So, when you go up to a pharmacist or a doctor and you say fleet, there is one specific thing that comes in our mind. You see that thing there? Yeah, basically, uh, if you guys don't know what it is, an like enema. An enema is that a liquid something that you squeeze up into your self and then you squeeze it back out <laughs> to kind of wash out your insides most of the times for like a colonoscopy or some foolishness like that so i don't know it's all of a sudden last week or a couple weeks back we just hear people like, out of the blue oh fleeting uh, fleeting is coming you know fleeting is going to replace instagram I'm like fleeting is going to replace instagram and then all of a sudden people are like oh fleet's nice i love fleeting like what's happening what's happening <laughs> me and all my other pharmacy people and all my doctor people are like what's happening anyway i just feel like they could have a better name than fleets i'm pretty sure that they, they, they combine flicks as in short short videos and tweets of fleets but no you gotta do something better another annoying thing that has emerged out of the blue since 2020 No, if I'm texting you and you send me this, that's it. Gone. Baby, I'm not even here. I'm a hallucination. Move around. Move. Oh my God, you're not gonna hear from me again, especially if we just start texting. If one of my friends them, my text feel cool, and then we see them in trying to incorporate, it's like no, it's never gonna be a thing. It's not fetch. Even Fetch had a better chance, but even then, it means I'm gonna disappear. Especially if it just that takes me. If it's a brand new business deal sponsorship, SML. Okay, all right, you know what? I really don't need your services. I never wanted the money anyway. I don't need that kind of money in my life. Um, but stop using SML, it's never gonna be a thing. Use an emoji or colon, close bracket. Close parentheses to what you say. One more thing I see on the rise here in Jamaica since 2020. I, I think it, it was it was a thing from 2019, but it just did have a little peak in, in 2020. Prank channels. Prank channels on YouTube, prank channels on Instagram, wherever you want to be prank channel, prank channels. So you mean if you tell me say you get prank Monday morning by your boyfriend or your girlfriend? 
And then Tuesday morning, you retaliate with the next prank. And now Wednesday, him and she are come to you to say, Oh, I want to break up with you. And you're still a far feet. Or something else happened and you're still a far feet. And it's not just Monday, Wednesday, Tuesday. It's been happening for the entire year. You've been releasing videos. Good. Consistency. Love it. Love the consistency. But you need to tell them to say, But I know. I don't know what prank is real or fake. Which what I'm saying is... They're fake. <laughs> and that, that is what really just kind of annoying to me now. It's like, we know say it's fake. No, it's fake. So you mean to tell me say you and the prank e the pranker and the pranky are staring at the camera so while the pranker keep and the prank full fully in a motion it's a kick full steam ahead and the two on the keep on a, babe why you do that we know we know it's fake it's annoying now it's weird it's getting weird pack it up pack it up and go pack it up it was a good liquor run it never was but pack it up now and not even to mention those weird pranks that are actual harmful, actually harmful, like the prank name where prank people tell them I get kidnapped. What? I remember a channel that pranked someone, did a kidnapping prank, and then when it was removed for being, you know, harmful and stuff like that, they were like, oh, haters. No, not haters. You, you just prank someone that they were getting kidnapped in a time when people are getting kidnapped. And then rubber prank, all these pranks that are either harmful or just fake and stupid. Stop it. We get it now. It was a fun ride. But stop it now. Pack it up. No, this video could not happen. I'm gonna mention the one she corona. No. We get it now. We get it. From last year. Last year this time we started and we were like, ah, China and them foolishness. And then now look at us. Now look at us. We get it. We understand. We never should under underestimate you. You chill, you find you fire, you lit, you lit corona. It's time now. Leave, please. Sick man, sick. I can't do nothing. And I'm holiday curfew, yeah. That's the thing, you know. Corona and the curfew then. Can't do nothing, you can't do nothing. Especially one time when we did work 12 hour shifts at the hospital. And it was like, as I come home, so everything locked. So by the time it's done, at like 8 o'clock, everything locked. No food, no nothing. And who come home from 12 hour shift to go cook? Me? No. <laughs> but yeah, Corona, she need to pack up and leave. She's just a nine. She a nine. She a nine. She mess up my carnival plans. In a year, yeah. You with carnival, Jamaica carnival. She mash up everything. Party plans, everything. Smash up. Who here I follow up with the news and here so them actually give the go ahead for dig up cockpit country for backside? That, that is, that, that, that not even annoying. She probably shouldn't even put in a video. Should I make a video? Things that are pissing me off. Cause I'm like, seriously, that is a, that's that landmark thing. That's like cockpit country. Later on down the years, it's gonna be, oh, there was, there was a really nice limestone thing there. You know, like limestone structures there. Very beautiful. Now look at the backside mine. Come on, man. That that's not cool. And the fact that you see so much people advocating against it, so much people signing petitions, this and that, this and that, and you're just gonna go ahead with it. You're not listening to your people. You're not. We just there. We just there. And this man and wave and in one. It's not cool. It's not cool, Andrew. Think it over. Think it over. And they were trying to do that somewhere else. You know, sent Anna some. But let's come on, man. Think about sustainability. Think about environment. Thing. It's like them just a look yeso. This is all them a look to. Oh, we can get some money yeso, and then deso. There's gonna be even more foolishness and even more expensive than we have got. Anyway, them them baga baga rain rain yeah. The rain, the storm them. When we did say we want a storm, that is not what we wanted. I mean, that that's not what we wanted either. That that is what we wanted, and that. Then they were that, not really that one. That's still better than that though. But no, you know, <laughs> when we say we want a storm and everybody that, we did want. It's bag of bag of rain every second. And you know what, a nine? You know what, really a nine about them? A weekend them I keep. So it's like the bright and early Monday morning, come go work. Friday evening, we have to go to rain start fall. Rain start fall until 12 a.m. Monday morning. So you know, after that, work, die a bed, wake up, work for the entire week, 
and then when you go weekend rain rain you need to pack up and then you ruin them now just a patty crumbs way it's gonna be so annoying if you fix them road over again that's one next annoying thing ruin them have to fix over again jamaican roads fam 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 what's the last thing camera stamp that 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 i love just any video i guess so because too much annoying thing i go on too much annoying thing i go on but yeah those are the most annoying things happening in jamaica to me right now and if you fix them then you need to pack up and go home or whoever is in charge of doing whatever need to stop anyway <laughs> thank you guys for watching this video if there's anything we're annoying on right now just comment it in the comments so that we can, you know, reply and be like, yes, I'll probably even make a part two video featuring Uno annoyances that I probably even, you know, agree with. I probably even ones that <laughs> don't really affect me, but I see someone I might just feature it in the next video. And if you guys want to see anything else, you know, outside the TTI series, or if you want to see our next TTI, you can just give me some ideas and I can put it down. So I can give you guys what you want and you can be entertained. You can be one big happy family. <laughs> but yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. Like it if you liked it, or just like it, you know, it's just to support, subscribe, and thing. You know, I'm gonna try to get to like a 500 subscriber goal. But, 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 the MDC vids family we reach 100 subscribers. Thank you guys so much for that. Oh, thank you. I <laughs> completely forgot to make a, um, a thank you video because last week I was, I was doing the the live with Mario Guthrie, which was really cool, by the way. If you guys haven't watched it, just, just you know, you know, that's how this said. Whatever side, just go check it out. Thank you guys so much for the 100 subscriber goal, though. But still, share up the channel and stuff so you know we can all reach 500 and MDC Vids family can go bigger and bigger and community can get bigger and all that. Things. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for coming this week and come back next week for a brand new video. Yeah, I'm gonna be here Tuesday again. <laughs>